Welcome back guys. This video is dedicated to all of you that wanted to see my uh, E6400 running at 3 gigs. A lot of you have asked how I've done it in the BIOS settings because some of you don't understand how to overclock and that. All I've really changed is the front side bus and the memory timers haven't really changed any voltage whatsoever but I'll, I'll just show you a quick little tour around of the uh, BIOS. Up here, click your extreme tweaker. You can see AI tuning I've got set to manual. I've got SLI ready memory enabled to expert, providing you have memory that's uh, SLI compatible. Link boost enabled. I disabled the NVIDIA GPU EX thing. I've got SLI broadcast aperture at auto. Well, I'll go down to the uh, front side bus and memory config and just show you my settings in there. As you can see, I've got the memory clock mode set as unlinked. I've got front side bus memory ratio set auto. The current uh, Front side bus of my CPU motherboard is 1500 MHz. The RAM is currently at 900. I'll just show you, uh, I can increase this just to show you how it changes as we put one by 50. As you can see, it actually slows the rate down of the RAM. You get to a certain point and then it starts slowing you. Slowing your rate, your RAM down, unless you uh, start putting the voltage up. I'll just set that back to 1500. As I said before, I haven't changed any of the voltages. They're all set to all. Oh, the only thing I've just slightly changed is some of the memory ones. Set that to. Uh, manual input rather than auto because Corsair recommend running at a 2.1 volt so that's what I've done. We'll just get out of here I'll show you the uh, system clocks as you can see I've just got them set basic and the uh, SPP MCP reference clock is still on auto. Overclocking as you can see he's running at 3 gigs multiplier is still set to 8 all the crappy stuff that slows the processor down and out when it's not really running games and stuff I've left to disabled I'll just have, rather have it running full throttle all the time and that's for that bit show you the over, vo over voltage settings as you can see I've got the memory voltage to 2.1 video core voltage is still auto CPU voltage is auto let's just go and show you a few of the settings on there just basically set it up a little bit more. But I'll just leave that as auto because I've had no problems with it running at 3 gigs on auto. If I want to overclock it slightly more then I'll whack the voltage up a little bit. DDR2 controllers are all on auto. North bridge and south bridge are on auto. Uh, I don't tend to use the uh, Asus AI overclocking software in Windows. For some reason on Windows 64 bit it stalls the system. Kind of crap, but there you go. So I just do it all manually. But if I set it in BIOS and it's fine when the program's loaded. Right there. Oops, wrong button. 
back out here. Come on, Dan. Uh, there's not much else that you can sort of change for the overclocking thing. You just got the Asus overclock profile, thing, which gives you the option to load from BIOS, etc. Don't want to know that. And that's about it. So I'll just let it boot. Try and hit tab for you quickly so you can see that. Three gigs, two CPUs. I'll show you the Asus utility once it's loaded. This version of XP is okay, it's just that some bloody things don't run. Bear with me one second here, the mouse is playing up. I'm worried. I'll show you the Asus utility once it's loaded. takes a little minute for it to figure out what's actually running at, why it's loading, rest of me applications etc. You can see the two CPU cores, are, one's at 22 and the other's at 24. Just waiting on Steam to finish loading now, takes forever, no matter what bloody PC you got on. Come on, man, it's taking ages. As you can see, the uh, front side bus is 1502, and the actual CPU is running at 3000 megahertz. Pretty good temperature as well, 44. Voltage is 1.30. So it's all good. You can see the memory ones there 2.10, 33 degrees, etc. Anyway, I hope that helps, and uh, I'll be doing a more in depth overclocking video pretty soon. Goodbye.